everyone, and welcome to Safety in Retirement. I'm your host, Paul Gebhardt, with my guest today, Mr. Lynn Strickler of LS Financial. Yeah. How are you doing, my friend? Doing good, doing good. I'm good having, to yeah, see you. Having a lot of fun here, huh? I yeah. know, I'm having a good time. I'm having a good time. You know, listen, we've gotten to know each other a little bit, and I've gotten to know a little bit about your story and what, what motivates you. But, you know, one of the things I, I found interesting is you're a multifaceted guy. I mean, you have a lot of different things in your background. <laughs> you know, the whole black belt and karate. Yeah, yeah. You know, yeah. and I told you I was going to hit you up about the whole Chuck Norris connection. Because right, right. I used to watch that show, like, religiously. Oh, man, yeah. oh I watched this religiously. But also, you were in the Airborne, right? Yeah, that's right. Yeah, that's right. I was uh, Special Forces. I'm, yeah. Um, back during the Vietnam era. Really? And uh, so, yeah, I've um, I jumped out of airplanes. Yeah. And uh, I use that analogy. You know, you know me, Paul. I, yeah. I, I've got a story, right? That sure, I can you got to. to. Absolutely. To what I do. Yeah. Um, you know, have you ever had that, that going over a hill or something, you had that sinking feeling, you know? Oh, yeah. You know, it's uh, terrible, right? I mean, yes. it's, like, it's scary. Right. Well, you can imagine, you know, an airborne, you're up there at 1,100 feet, and all of a sudden they hit you, boom, out the door. <laughs> well, you talk about a sinking feeling. Really? Yeah, it's unbelievable. But what that reminds me of, okay, is the roller coaster ride that folks are on in retirement. Mm. I mean, think about it. You know, pre-retired or, or retirement, you're you're on that roller coaster and it's going up and you're happy. Last ten years, man, it's sure, click, click, you're click, climbing, click, 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 yeah, click, yeah. You know, and it's going, it's great. And all of a sudden, you drop. Mm. Now, folks, let me. Can you handle that in retirement? You mm. can't handle another 08 in retirement. Mm. So that sinking feeling, it's going to be pretty intense because we're about to have another correction. What goes up will come down. Yeah. Now, I don't know when. I don't, sure. I don't have a crystal ball. But I would say that uh, being in the market mm. when you're in retirement, we want to help you get safe. Yeah. Okay. Here's what I want to do. I want to help you to when you jump, you look up, and you got a parachute that opens. Yeah. Because that was one of our biggest fears. Yeah. 1001, 1002, <laughs> 1003, 1004, check canopy. That's, that was your instructions. Yep. And every time I looked up, I thought, oh, thank God. Thank you, Lord. <laughs> right. right. So I want to help you mm. that your parachute's going to open. I like that. Yeah. What a great analogy, like a parachute through retirement. There you go. I love it. That's, that's good, awesome. Lynn. I think you're onto something, my friend. Because <laughs> that's a great analogy, because you're absolutely right. Yeah. Think about that. Everything he mentioned right there is what we all go through that anxiety we fear, right? That yeah. what's my future going to look like? Will I have enough money? When can I retire? Right. You know, and having that parachute is probably likened to what a good plan. That's exactly right. That's exactly right. We've talked about it before, but you've got to have a plan. Mm. You know, folks will spend more time planning a vacation <laughs> right. than they will planning their future and their retirement. Mm, interesting. Isn't that amazing? Yeah. So, yeah, you're right. It's, it's like having a parachute. And, yeah. and you need to have a good parachute, and it needs to open yeah, right. when you need it to open. That's right. <laughs> doesn't need to be one of those, wait, wait a minute, wait to right. open until next January. Right. That's the wrong time to wrong figure time. out, yeah. right, when yeah. you're already falling. Absolutely. You know, it's interesting, the, the analogies and stuff that you give and talking about planning. So let's say there's some people out there that, you know, maybe they're on the fence, and they're thinking about what you're talking about. And they don't know what they don't know, but they know they're a little bit anxious about maybe reaching out, Right. What are some of the things that folks need to bring once they meet with you? Are there any certain expectations they need to have right out of the gate, Lynn? You know, Paul, I'll be honest with you. I, I just want them to come in and, we you know, our first meeting, I'm going to get to know you. Mm. I, I mean, you know, I have these other financial advisors say, oh, bring this in, bring your taxes in, bring that. I don't know if I can help you. I don't know if I can significantly help you. Yeah. So I got to get to know you. I got to get to know your goals. So the first time you come in, I don't want you to just come in and meet with me. Let's talk. Let's yeah. get to know each other. Mm. Then we'll decide if we want to work together. Yeah. Okay. If it works for us. Yeah. And then we'll go forward. How are we with questions, Lynn? Are, do you do word? Do, do folks have, ask too many questions or? No. I, I, the more questions you ask, the better. You, mm. you, you've got to ask questions. How are you going to learn? There's no, there's no dumb question. Mm. And I tell folks this all the time. I told you before, I help a lot of widows, a lot of, lot of widowed women and, and men. But look, they ask question after question because they have no clue. Sure. Not, no yeah. clue. And so my, my first part is to educate you. I do not want any client to be a client of mine if they are not educated and they don't know exactly what they have and what they're getting. Mm. That's important to me. I'm not here to sell you anything. Man. Yeah. I mean, I, I'm going to help you. Right. 
And there's a lot of information out there, too, Lynn. I mean, that's just the thing. I think most people, it's the confusion of knowing, you know, what information really applies to me. Right. When right. so much of it is kind of generalistic. Yeah. It's kind of the one, you know, size fits all kind of mantra. Right. Yeah, that's true. And until you get into your specific plan, mm. right, it, that's, it's got to be your plan. Right. It's got to be specific to you. Um, there's a lot of, um, you know, the, the Internet so is, is a danger, can be a dangerous place. It sure can. I mean, it can be a good place, a wonderful but, resource, but yeah. there's some bad stuff that goes on out there that's just yeah. not correct. So, yeah, I think having a good uh, financial advisor, somebody can trade. Look, the first thing, Paul, is this. People will do business with people they know, they like, and they trust. Tr yes. And trust is huge. Yep. If you don't have trust, so how can you, tr how can I, you come in on the first meeting and me try to sell you something? Right, exactly. I yeah. trust built yet. Yeah, exactly. I don't even help you do anything. They haven't done anything, exactly. I haven't even gotten to know what right. the goals what are. You, what you want. Yeah, is it something you can even help me with, That's right? right? That's right. I mean, because I think that's a key component, right? Is, Absolutely. Is knowing that. And I, and I tell folks, treat it like an interview process, truly. You know, yeah. and do that in your current situation. If you have a situation right now and you've been comfortable over time, remember this is the business of your retirement, the one and only. That's right. It's not a dress rehearsal, right, Lynn? That's it. That's it. You, you know, you got to get it right. You got to get it right. There's no second chances here, Ugh. really. But the, you know, other, I mean, I have had helped people, you know, come out of some ditches. Yeah. But but it's better to go ahead and get a good plan and, and get it off to the right, you know, right foot. But yeah. I will say this: um, it's never too late. Mm. It's never too late to get. You know, help. Mm. So you That's know, good. unless you don't have look, if, if you don't have any money, guys. All right. The first rule of thumb I teach you is that you have to have six months of income or, or expenses behind you. Yeah. You got to have that okay. behind you. Okay. And you know, if you don't have a four hundred one k or you don't have an IRA, you know, and I, I have folks that come to me, uh, Paul, and they they have they say, oh, I don't I don't have any money. Well, what can I do? Well, I can help educate them and help give them some materials and things like that. If you don't have some dollars for me to help you plan with, okay, you probably don't need to come in. I'm just being straight. Yeah. You know. Right. But if, if but I will always take your call. I'll always take your call. If you if you need I, I help a lot of people just get them resources. Mm. So I don't have a problem doing that. But really where we help folks is where they have uh, some money, it's usually a four oh one K or an IRA mm -hmm. and, and it's either qualified or non qualified, but they have that money. Uh, that they need to get working in a different direction. Okay? Yeah. Or they have it sitting in a bank, right? Get, what are you going to get in a bank? <laughs> nothing. Wait, nothing, okay? Yeah. I had a folks uh, a couple weeks ago came in. They had, I, I think it was nine $100,000 CDs. Oof. What are you going to do with CDs today? Yeah. What are they getting? <laughs> not Where, much, that's not for much, sure. Not much. Where are you going to put your money, folks? Mm. And you want to get it off that roller coaster. And the only place you can put it is with a, fixed indexed annuity that will always be there for you. You'll never lose your principal, and you're going to get some nice upside. Mm, nice, good stuff. It's pretty good. Hey, listen, we're going to take a break here in a second, but I understand you've got a, an offer you wanted to share with the viewer today. Yeah, yeah. absolutely, absolutely. Just what we were talking about, folks, uh, if we can help you in any way, uh, come on in. Uh, if you've got the mon guaranteed money, if you've got an IRA, um, you know, whether it's guaranteed or non-guaranteed, you know, um, uh, guaranteed, come on in and we'll help you. Um, some of it may be qualified, non-qualified, but uh, come on in and we'll, we'll do a plan for you. We'll actually help you with taxes, inflation, make sure that you have the longevity, that you, your money's going to go the distance with you. Mm. Uh, so come on in, we'll, be, we'll help you. And I'm also going to give you a complimentary uh, book. Uh, I've collaborated with Tom Higna, who has a PBS special called Don't Worry, Retire Happy. It's either this one or this one. He's got another one I've worked with him on called Paychecks and Playchecks, which is also pretty good. <laughs> so... Come on in, and we'll be glad to help you out. It's 844-299-0355. That's 844-299-0355. And again, that's completely complimentary. I've seen folks charge as much as $1,500 for a consultation. But the key is you have to take action today. Reserve your spot because spots are limited. I think yeah. we're doing 10 today. So please reach out, get your reservation, sit down and do a review with Lynn and his team. Could be the one thing that puts you on the path to complete financial freedom. Again, 844-299-0355. we got to take a quick break. We're going to be right back after these messages. How confident are you in your current financial plan? Do you know with certainty how the recent market volatility will affect your future hopes and dreams? How much are you paying in taxes? 
And how much are you losing to unnecessary high fees? You didn't work to save this money so that you could spend your time worried in retirement. Now is the time to take charge of your finances so you can feel confident about your future. Call in during the next 30 minutes of today's show only to set up an absolutely complimentary, no obligation, full-blown financial review that will result in your own customized written plan. This is a $999 value that we're giving away complimentary to the first 10 people who respond. We'll start with a full-blown analysis of what you already have. By running a report to untangle how much you are currently paying in fees, how you're allocated for risk, and what it's costing to work with your current advisor. Next, we'll identify your goals. Where do you see yourself in the next five years? Where do you want to go, and who do you hope to go there with? Is your current financial plan set up to get you there without mishap? Let's design a roadmap to create a financial plan you can follow with confidence. Get the piece that so many people are missing from their retirement. Find out how having a written plan can make a difference to your retirement dreams. Call now to schedule your complimentary, no-obligation, full-blown financial review today. Welcome back, everyone, to Safety in Retirement. I'm your host, Paul Gebhardt, with my special guest today, Lynn Strickler of LS Financial Group. But again, wonderful segment on parachuting and making sure you get <laughs> safely through retirement. That was good stuff, Lynn. I wanted to ask you a little bit, What do you? how about folks out there that, you know, maybe they work for an employer, it's a big outfit, um, they get a 401k. Uh, let's be honest, the HR departments, they're not really astute at training people and helping them through a 401k. If they've got an outside 401k, can they come to you with some advice? Absolutely, absolutely. Yeah. We help a lot of folks with 401ks. And you're absolutely right. There are a lot of folks, they've worked at, you know, maybe it was years ago. Yeah. And they, they have a 401k and they forgot about it. Mm -hmm. right? That was my next question, but that's great. Yeah, Keep I mean, going. I mean, they forgot about yeah. it. And, and, and they don't understand that there's a thing called provisional income. Mm. And what happens is if you have, a, what, what you have to do, especially when you're at age 72, you've got what's called requirement, required minimum distributions that you've got to pay. See, the government says, we're going to let you defer which they let you do that, right, with yes. the 401ks. Yep, put it off. But we're going to get the money sooner or later yeah. out of you. Right? Yep. So we've got to be cognizant of that and be ready to help folks mm, with that. Okay? Good point. Good but point. if you do not, if you do not, re, uh, 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 what do you call it, get that uh, RMD, if you do not take that and take care of it, it's 3.5%, okay, is what they're, anything you've got in your, in your uh, 401ks, IRAs, they add that up, 3.5% mm -hmm. that you're going to have to pay. And what happens is if you don't pay it, here's how serious they are about getting their money back. It's a 50% penalty. 50%? 50%. So they're real serious about getting that money back. Wow. So, yeah, a lot of folks don't don't understand that that uh, these 401ks, you know, you, you got to really keep on top of this stuff. Mm -hmm. The other thing is you you probably want to roll that over mm. uh, into, you know, may, maybe they have multiple 401ks. We see that all the time. Yeah. So let's roll it into one. Right. Right. And consolidate it. So you're not worried, you know, your stuff's everywhere. Let's consolidate that, yeah. though, that 401k. Yeah. So, and I think it's important, too. I mean, Lynn, what you're, you're speaking of, like folks out there that might have left an employer and left a 401k behind, it's kind of dormant at that point. Right. You can't contribute to it anymore, and it kind of sits, is what you're talking about, right? right? That's correct. Yeah, and, and again, you know, HR departments, they're not helping these no. folks. They don't, you know, and, and then here they are with all these uh, other things that they can invest in. Yep. And they have not a clue. Right. They really don't. And so we're there to help them with that, right? Even their current 401k. Right, we they may not be able to touch that right now until they leave. So it depends on the companies. Right, but we'll we'll help them and guide them. We got a lot of folks that have four hundred one k's, and they'll come to us and they'll say, "Well, here's where I, I've got these options. Where should I put it?" Well, we'll try to help them get it as safe as we possibly can. Right, because right? that's our whole mission: safety and retirement. Right. So you know, but yeah, they have to get some help. But most folks don't know what to do with um, th with their four hundred one k's. They don't know where to put it. Right, and. A lot of times they'll go to their friend, and a friend says, do this, do that. You know, they need to get professional help. Exactly, because it's all a part of their retirement. It's just one more piece right. that they need to allot for. Absolutely. You need to get some professional advice on it. Right. What about Roth conversions? I hear a little bit about Roth conversions. Why would somebody want to really consider doing something like that, Lynn? You know, Roth conversions is kind of interesting. The We, we talk about three buckets. Okay? Yeah. We talk about the first bucket over here 
is where you have, you get a 1099. Yep. Okay. And this is where you have your bank account, your checking account, whatever. The middle bucket is going to be your deferred, your 401k, your IRAs, et cetera. There's another bucket over here that we talk about that we want to try to get you to, and that's called the tax-free bucket. Okay? Yeah, that sounds good. It's very nice. And I always <laughs> ask people, I say, how many of you in here uh, would like to get totally off the IRS radar screen? Whew. Well, do you think anybody's not going to raise their hand? Of course they're going to raise their hand. Yeah. So what happens with those Roth conversions is we're able to move that money. The government says you can move that money, you can do a conversion over to a Roth from a 401k, right? But you have to pay the taxes on it. See, mm. they got smart. That was back in 2010 or so. Used to, you couldn't do that. You couldn't, you couldn't convert. And they, then they started going, hmm, if we let them convert, they have to pay the taxes. Ah. Uh, yeah. So you got to pay the tax on it. To uh, convert it. That's so right. they're going, wow, we got more for the kitty. Let them convert away. <laughs> right. you know? More and money for us. Yeah, yeah. So exactly. They just kicked the can down. That's all they've been doing. Yeah, just kicked yeah, the can down yeah, the street. Yeah. But but the thing about that is what we say is, folks, if you're going to do it, do it now. Because mm. taxes are on sale. Mm. I mean, how many of you think that what's going on with our country, okay, looking at the market, the volatility, look at cities burning, mm. $30 trillion in debt, that yeah. doesn't even count the interest we got owe on it. Yeah. Inflation, right? Yeah. Um, I think right now taxes are probably on sale. Yeah. They're the lowest agree. they've ever been, by the way. I but, don't know if you know that. No. In 1963, we had a president named President Ronald Reagan. He only made two movies in 1963. You know why? Why? Because of the taxes. He was charged 92% at the time. What? Our country has had 92% tax rate. 92%? Yeah, 92%. Wow. So if you look at a graph and a chart, we are at the lowest tax rates we've been in, in a number of years. Mm. So we do say taxes are on sale because I do believe they're about to go you up again. You think they have to push them back up at some point? Well, it always hits the middle class. Oh. They say, oh, it's not going to hit. Believe me, it always does. Always does. So, but here's the key. If you can get that money over into that Roth bucket, and the only two things that go in that bucket, by the way, they're tax-free, is life insurance and anything Roth. Okay. Mm. So we want to get you over there into that Roth, right? Pay the taxes now because you, we're going to show you how to grow it anyway. We're going to get that back. We're going to show you how to grow it inside here. Gotcha. Right? But here's the thing. When you go to take it out, it's tax-free. Completely. Completely tax-free. So you pay a little bit of the tax up front. That's right. You help them recuperate that, yeah, what they've paid we, out. Right. After they've got it converted in there. And then now any growth, right. they get 100% of that is tax-free. Tax-free. Wow. That's where you want to be. Well, you'd think everybody would want to Life be Life insurance, that. same thing. Life insurance, tax-free. You, 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 it's the only instrument that's still out there that you take. And, and the government gives you a certain quarter that you can do. See, yeah. when we do life insurance, yeah. Paul, what, what we do is, is we flip it upside down. It's not death benefit. That's not what okay. we do. We flip it upside down. And really? inside there is a fixed indexed annuity type of a product. Okay? It's called IUL. Okay. Yeah. Indexed universal life. Yeah. And so we're going to build as much cash in there as the government will allow us. Mm. And so we build cash inside that life insurance policy. Okay. And again, now, when you go to take it out, tax free. Really? It's a, it's a beautiful thing. 85% of the CEOs in this country use that strategy. All right. Listen up out there. So what do you say? There's popular radio hosts out there telling people that, ah, term life insurance is the only kind of insurance you want to do. Oh, yeah. Crazy. That's baloney, isn't crazy. it? Yeah, I mean, look, here's the thing. <laughs> yeah. if, if, if you have the discipline. Now, if you don't have anything, mm -hmm. all right, I'd say go, you know, get some term get insurance some term, if, right. it's for, if, it's for, if it's for death benefit. That's right. Okay. But if you're looking to grow mm -hmm. money, grow cash inside of, a, of, of an instrument yeah. that you can get tax-free, then this is the way to go. Yep. The thing about buy term, invest the difference. That oh, was yeah. a big thing, right? That's a funny one. The funny thing is, most people don't have the discipline to do it anyway. No. And the interesting part about it is it's actually a marketing term that was developed by the largest term insurance company out there. Yeah. Well, of course they would tell you to do that. Of course. You know, but that, it's, it's an interesting point that you made. It's, you have to look at it differently, and it's all by design. You're talking about a strategy, right? Right. That's correct. Hey, listen, we're going to take another break, but would you mind sharing with folks? There's a few spots. The phones have been going crazy, Lynn, yeah. so they're loving you, buddy. But <laughs> would you share with them again what you're offering? Yeah, sure. Well, and this, like we just talked about, mm. if, if you folks want to look at a Roth conversion, mm. we take a look at your your what you've got in your 401ks, your IRAs. We certainly want to make sure that you uh, you know take care of that uh, provisional income. 
Uh, we want to make sure that, you know, if you have an old one, we can move it, make sure we get it over so you don't get hit with a 50%, mm. you know, uh, hit, hit on that's pretty amazing. Yeah. Um, call, come on in and see me. We'll be glad to help you. We'll put a plan together for you that takes these things we just talked about into play. Uh, we'll get make sure you get, you're in a safe place. If you do a Roth conversion, we're going to make that money back for you folks. You're going to end up having zero taxes. We want to get you off the IRS radar screen, okay? Mm. And there is a way to do it. So give me a call. I've also got a book that uh, I'll give you one of the two books that I've uh, collaborated with Tom Higna on, uh, Paychecks and Playchecks, and also uh, Don't Worry, Retire Happy, Seven mm. Things That You Need to Do in Retirement. We'll be more than happy to get that to you complimentary. Give me a call at 844-299-0355. Wonderful stuff. And let me ask you a question. How can change take place if you don't take action? If you don't take action, pick up the phone. It's a complimentary. 844-299-0355. we got to take a quick break. We'll be right back after these messages. As a good saver, you've been putting away money during your working years. Studies find that the biggest fear of retirees is running out of money. Market volatility isn't just the downward movement of stock prices, it's the size and frequency of change. The more dramatic the ups and downs, the higher the volatility. This can put savers who are newly retired or a few years away from being retired at greater risk. Today's generation of retirees is not receiving traditional pensions as our parents or grandparents did. Instead, we have retirement accounts such as 401ks or 403bs. These accounts typically expose your money to market risk. The last thing you want right before retirement is to lose a portion of the money you need for income. But how do you turn these accounts into a retirement income? Is it safe to keep all your retirement money sitting in the stock market? The last thing you want is to lose a portion of the money you need for income due to market loss. By working with a financial professional, you can learn how to turn a portion of your savings into an income stream for life and income for the life of your spouse if you're married. We all have moments in our lives when we wish we had taken action sooner. Don't let procrastination rain on your retirement parade. Act now before it's too late. Please call our office to set up your no-cost, no-obligation retirement income review today. Welcome back, everybody, to Safety in Retirement. I'm your host, Paul Gephardt. Again, my guest here today has been Lynn Strickler. Lynn, I'm telling you, I've truly enjoyed you, my yeah, friend. I have, too. I'm the stories, it. which are my favorite parts, you know what I mean? I can relate to the story, you know, and I'm sure a lot of you folks can, too. Stories resonate with people. Uh, I wanted to ask you a little bit about a topic, you know, that I think everybody right now is riding pretty high and doing very well in the markets. We've seen, what, a steady incline for 10 years. Mm -hmm. But right. I would think as we're getting closer and closer to our retirement, as the years are going by, um, we need to really start thinking about market volatility again. Wouldn't you agree? Absolutely. Absolutely. I, matter of fact, I think that, be, be, you know, the one thing is, of course, folks worry about is can they, where their income go the distance with them, right? Mm. That's the number one fear. Yes, but another fear is is exactly that. What's going to happen if we have another 08? What happens if we have the tech bubble above 2000? Mm. Yeah. Um, you, you just, again, in retirement, you just cannot afford to have that happen. Um, the, I mean, look at it. We got a $30 trillion debt right now. Mm. We're printing more and more money like crazy. Again, it's feeling like uh, 08 again. The, mm. the housing market is taking off. You know, if you look back, and this, this is true, if you look back over since 1929, we've had a correction every seven years, okay? Every seven years, we yeah. usually have a market correction, and it goes down 39%. Yeah, you're right. So we've gone about 10 or 11 years. It's, you know, it, the good uh, chances that this is going to come down. But here's the thing. You know, if you're 40 years old or whatever, like my boys, you know, hey, you want to ride it out? Don't, the market does come back. Sure. It'll come back. But... When you're in retirement, you can't afford that to happen. Yeah. If, if you look in, in, in 1998, you put $100,000 in, and that market went up nicely. You're really happy. Oh, sure. It's going great, you know. And then, and, and you know what's the other thing is you're real happy paying your advisor <laughs> at 2 or 3%. <laughs> hey, True. that's great. I'll yeah. take you to dinner. Yeah, you're not missing it. Yep. But what happens when all of a sudden that market goes down like it did? Oh, you ain't kidding. 30, 40% of your money's gone. <sighs> yeah. Okay. Now, how you liking me now? Yeah, not really. Yeah, uh-huh. Yeah. 
man, I still got to pay you, by the way. Yeah. The no, that's so true. Yeah. For losing my money. Mm. Mm, no, nah, that doesn't feel too good. Yeah. So in retirement, you can't, put, if you look back at that, it took seven years, if you look at the graph that we usually show our clients, mm -hmm. to get back even. Wow, seven, seven years, years to recuperate. To where recuperate. You, oh. and, and that's if you didn't take any money out. <sighs> yeah. If you didn't take any money out for your retirement. Well, and to be real, I mean, how could you sit still and wait the seven years on top of that, right? I mean, that's, the reality is you have to live during that seven. That's exactly right. You need money from you somewhere. You got to have money from somewhere. So you're taking more and more out. It's, 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 it's very ugly. Oh boy, I ain't kidding. I mean, you know, I, I kid around on my radio show. I say, you know, look, folks, I got, I, I got people that won't even buy green bananas. <laughs> really? <laughs> Come on. <laughs> well, I'm going to try to, I'm going to try to, you know, I've got some elderly clients. Mm. They can't afford it. I mean, look, yeah. they, they may not be here in two or three or four years. Yeah. How are they going to wait seven? <laughs> How are they wait seven? <laughs> that's a, a wonderful point. We're talking about the incredible value of time, right? I think that's a one thing that we all miss. It's like it's a, it's a double whammy, really. It's not it, it just is. the money. That's right. It's the time you lose with the money. Absolutely. Right? Absolutely. Yeah. The, and again, um, why do you want to worry about all that? No. Be in the market. I mean, nope. go see your grandkids. Yes. You know, it's like Tom said. You want to live your life. Look. Don't worry, retire happy. I love that. What a yeah, great idea for me. You should sing that song to him, Lynn. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> <laughs> I think they get a kick out of that. Uh, well, anyway. you know, we're coming down to the end of another program, and I just wanted to tell you, thank you from the oh, bottom of my heart. I mean, yeah, I've, I've really I've enjoyed it. Probably. I've really enjoyed having you. You're just a good guy, and you're funny. <laughs> and and who's who's to say? I mean, you're supposed to have fun and money. I mean, what are you doing this for? Yeah. If absolutely. you can't have fun, and if you're not having fun, you most definitely got to call in, right? Got to <laughs> right. change things up a little bit. Because that's what this is about. In all seriousness, it's about you. What do you see in your future? What do you want your tomorrow to be? What have you dreamed? And are you in a position to realize those dreams? More than likely, it's someone you love to spend time with more and never have to worry about punching a clock, never have to worry about, am I going to have enough money? Do you know that the money is there for you because you planned because you sat down with Lynn and his team and let them build a customized retirement, a personal pension plan. The call is complimentary. The review is completely complimentary. You get to meet with them in person. 844-299-0355. Make the call. We want to thank you for being with us today. Be well and enjoy your retirement.